I think if we're going to ask people to support the change of the global economy, we need to make sure it improves their quality of life. So well-being suggests an improvement, suggests a better life, suggests a change in the way we are with others, with our economy, with nature. So well-being is an attractive term because it's positive. Building on what I understand as well-being as an aspirational way to engage people in economic reform, the Green Economy Coalition, which I represent, needs to find ways to articulate an improved quality of life. So I'm here to explore how well-being might be the way that we break through and find a way to articulate an improved quality of life that economies can deliver. We need to change our global economy. We need to change it so that it understands and its dependency on nature and its relationship with nature. We need to make sure that a third of the world's population does not get left behind and left in poverty. We need to make sure that there is an inclusive story where people can all prosper. And that new economy can come about. It is starting to come about. But we need better ways to break through. We need more people talking about this. We need more people acting on this. We need more people collaborating. There is an alternative. And well-being economies might well break through into the mainstream and show people that there is a better quality of life and a better way to run the world. We hope you join.